Welcome back to the show. We're outside Jobbing.com Arena as the San Jose Sharks are about to get ready to take on Wayne Gretzky's Phoenix Coyotes. You know, we're on the dad's trip with the team in the Windy City and in Music City, USA. And we caught up with Ryan Clough and his dad and Mr. Shelley as they headed to practice in Chicago. How many fathers? Yeah. There's 18 fathers and two brothers. Do you do any warm-ups or anything? Or we do some team stretch, but that's usually when the, the trainer is here. Yeah, unless the trainer... I thought Joe had a long stick. He's got a long reach. It's great. Great to be around it all to see how, what takes place. and uh, You don't get to hang out and spend time. Because you don't really get to do during the season. You are seeing what you the ground the bus, on the plane, gone again. So. So usually this is a great, great opportunity to uh, spend some time. After games, and you just want to take pictures. Yeah. You can take his eyelash, right? Yeah. Yeah, I think I paid for them. <laughs> <I did. laughs> yeah, right side. Right side, left hand shot. shot. <laughs> Coming out of that like Messi. I think it's, uh, you know, it's just a proud, proud thing as a dad to see that those guys are uh, so friendly together or they uh, socialize so much together. It's great to see them so excited, uh, you know, even getting on the plane, uh, being around the guys. You know, he's, he's a big fan of, uh, of me and of the team and uh, you know, he's just excited and, and all the little things that sometimes we take for granted. Uh, it's just good to see him get excited about those things. So. You guys have oh. a beer before the game now? <laughs> it's like old Chicago Stadium. Down here with the D-Man. I'm sure you talked to the day, boys. I'm like, up. All right, let's go. The thing, looking at those guys today, how professional they are and how uh, athletic and, uh, you know, the way they uh, treat each other. And... You like to get that wind up in too, eh? Come on, Junior, eh? When he's really, really, you know, focused on something and he's been like that his whole career, you know, that's the way he's been. When you tell him he can't do something, well, you know, get out of the way, he's going to prove you wrong, you know, and that's, that's how he worked his way up to where he's to now. And yeah, yeah. I mean, he did everything for me. I mean, I wouldn't be here without, without my dad. I think everyone can say that. It's, uh, you know, he, he coached me, he advised me, he, uh, Drove me. I mean, they they made a lot of sacrifices. My parents uh, to uh, to get me in a position that uh, I had to be in, and, and uh, so they did everything that, that had to be done. I figure young Dale said you two had more stuff today. I'm in there. I'm awake. I'm awake. Just just to see him in the shape he's in, and the, uh, you know they're all uh, they're all such uh, gentleman type of guys. Oh, nice, Boosh! What a great ice surface, though, eh? Perfect for us. You learn from your dad. I mean, he works hard. He, he doesn't. Uh, he doesn't give up on things. So why would I? Ryan Clo cut short our mic'd up segment when the microphone went flying off him in practice, and then Brad Lukwich cut it off altogether when he skated over the mic wire, thus ending any sound we could get for you the things we go through to get behind the scenes on Shark Bites. <laughs>